What's up, Melissa? Hey, Steve. Mm. Mm. One second. Oh, my God. Magic spoon, though. Mm. Magic spoon. FHS White Stallion, what up? Exciting changes, exciting changes, exciting changes are happening. Exciting changes, exciting changes, exciting changes. Boom, boom. Mm. What we munching on? What we munching on? Just some magic spoon. Peanut butter and cocoa flavor with our powers combined can become a Reese's Puffs with no grain, that's all protein, no sugar, delicious. Gang, I tried to move heaven and earth, -ah. heaven and earth, -ah. to have the stream be on time, to have YouTube memberships enabled, so much. But we're here and we have to be grateful that we are here right now Woo! oh my god cocoa pb2 in homemade oats is the best breakfast that does sound incredible as a person who loves peanut butter in oatmeal that does sound like the absolute hotness to be fair what do we think about this new camera angle it looks like i'm looking directly into chat Oh, hello, Tony Spurgeon on YouTube. How are you? Tony Spurgeon, where are you from? What's your pet's name? What's your favorite sandwich? Greetings from Texas. How are you doing? How are you doing? How's your family doing? Give me an update, please, Tony. I'm glad to see that you have you have internet. I'm hoping you have heat too. I'm looking right into your soul as you type Steve Lenhart photo. Oh, ho, ho, ho! Becky Francis with the 10 month resub. Can we get some A's in chat? Whatever chat you're in, multiple A's, please. Well, I made it to 10 months and I'm glad to be part of this chapter of whatever this craziness is. Yes, that's what's up. Thank you so much, Becky. I adore you. We all adore you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Last week was crazy. You're also in Texas. White Stallion, okay. Tony says we're doing much better. We have power and water back. Good. Good. Is that what it says? Oh, shit. <laughs> the announcement was supposed to be the uh, freaking memberships were live over on YouTube, but they're not live because YouTube is really, mm, really futzing with me right now. I sat through on it for an hour with one of their chat specialists who gave me no information that was useful. And all I wanted to do, all I did was change the price of the lowest tier of membership from $4.99 to $3.99 so that you guys would be able to support me the same as you do on Twitch. I would get the same amount of money, but you would spend less. That's all I wanted to do. And now I don't know how many days it'll take until I can actually turn them on. But the video is shot and posted. I wrote a post. I did the, the badges and the emoji. Once we have three people who have memberships, we can add more emotes. We got more stuff here. Hold on. Tony Spurgeon. Prof Sai, Good to see you. Daddy. You wanted to remove money from YouTube? Did they lose their shit? <laughs> well, clearly they're not thrilled because my memberships are still in review. Um, LA can take the leaves. Well, you can take the leaves to LA, but you can't take the LA out of the leaves. All right, Tony Spurgeon's pet's name is Becky. Bucky, he's my dog. He's a Cocker Spaniel. My favorite sandwich is a tuna mouth. All right, can I get some help on a coal mine song real quick? If my mouth can work. 
Tony Spurgeon has a dog named Bucky, and they're from Texas. Their favorite sandwich is a tuna melt. Working in a coal mine all day, every single day, with Bucky right by your side. Making sure that everybody has some sweet Texas vibes up here in the coal mine. Having a good time, melting a tuna melt on the griddle in the coal mine. Isn't that a good time? Having a good time with coal mine. In the coal mine with Tony and Bucky in the coal mine Having a tuna melt sandwich in the coal mine Such a good time Bang! Welcome to the community Dear sweet Tony Spurgeon over on YouTube Alright, Becky can't stick around That's okay Much love to you, Becky Take care Be healthy, be happy, be safe Take very good care of yourself We need you we all need a Becky Francis in our life. It's true. Oh, I'm so glad, Tony. That makes me very happy that you liked it. Welcome. We stream Monday through Thursday, 9 a.m. and 6 p.m. Pacific. Daddy PandaVid89 over on Twitch. Thank you for the follow. Much appreciated. What's your favorite sandwich? What's your pet's name? Where are you from? So I can give you your coal mine song. Um, FHS asks, if Mixer was still a company, would you rather change to their platform? No, no, I don't think so. I don't think Mixer was ever going to capture enough of the marketplace um, to really be a viable option. I can, I understand why like Shroud and Ninja went to Mixer because they were getting paid to go to Mixer. Um, I probably would stream there as well. And maybe if we like caught on like crazy, that would be a thing. But I, w I don't think I would base myself entirely on Mixer. If Twitch didn't have... Matt Leaves says Panda Vid. Welcome, Panda Vid. Am I streaming live on Parlor? God no. Welcome, C Reed. Welcome, Night Road. Um, if Twitch didn't have their fucking exclusivity shit in the in the affiliate agreement, if they if they didn't make you be exclusive, um, then there wouldn't be an issue. I would just stream everywhere and it wouldn't be a thing. I would just multi-stream. And I, I still will, but I'm going to demonetize my Twitch um, because I don't like the way Amazon does business. I am I was going to delete my Twitch. Sammy talked me out of it because she's smart. And I wasn't being smart. I was maybe being... I don't know. I had like a thunderbolt of clarity. And I was like, ooh, it's going to be like Unus Anus. Um, yay, Sammy's here. Uh... Yeah, I'm just, I'm moving my my monetization and the methods by which people can support me to YouTube, Facebook, and Patreon. And there won't be any more Twitch subs. There won't be any more cheering on Twitch. I don't like the way that, uh, that Amazon, in my opinion, takes advantage of users um and uh takes money out of the pocket of creators i just don't i don't care for it um sammy's good to see you welcome yeah I, I people just love twitch and i love the twitch culture don't get me wrong um i love the twitch culture i do have a tip uh tip button yeah, so I, I could just encourage people to go to LibermanPlays.com and tip if they wanted to, or they could do a super chat on Twitch. Um, Shink Diesel on YouTube, pet name Lucy, my dog. Favorite sandwich is a steak and cheese because reasons. Shink Diesel, can you tell me where you're from? It could even just be a country. Country, state, whatever you prefer. Always only PayPal your favorite Twitch streamers donations. You actually can't call it donations. You actually have to call it tips under the law. I found that out in the last month. Everyone who calls it donations, myself included, uh, is in big trouble. Because unless you're a 501c3, you cannot call claim anything is a donation. Or else uh, you're in big trouble with the federal government. Okay. Shank Diesel on YouTube is from Ohio. 
has a pet named Lucy and their favorite sandwich is a steak and cheese. Working in a coal mine all day, every single day with Lucy by your side. Making sure that everybody knows that a steak and cheese is an incredible sandwich in the coal mine. Having a good time making those steak and cheese sandwiches with the cheese whiz or the American or the provolone in the coal mine with the onions and the peppers and Lucy's getting a bit of the beef under the counter she's real happy about the beef in the coal mine bang welcome to the community shink diesel on youtube thank you very much consider dropping a sub if you haven't already much appreciated memberships should be live tomorrow owen i will breathe when i'm dead <laughs> fhs white stallion I have nothing against pepper jack on a cheesesteak, but, but if we're getting real, the triumvirate of official cheesesteak, steak and cheese cheeses from Philly are cheese whiz, American cheese, or provolone cheese. Thank you, Jay Riojas. How are you doing today? Give me an update. I'm a dually hello. Do we all get monogram jackets? I think I did make a jacket at one point on LibermanPlays.com, but I took it down. I took it down. I think if I could put my Tucci design on the back of a of like a Letterman's jacket, I would. We still have those uh -oh, limited. Uh -oh. Whoa! The wind bag. Thank you so much for the raid. Uh oh, love. Windbag, what were you streaming? How are you? Welcome, Raiders. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Lieberman. I hope that you're having the best day ever. If you're not, tell me why, and I'll do my best to change that right away. Uh, we stream all kinds of stuff. We stream Monday through Thursday, 9 a.m. Pacific and 6 p.m. Pacific. Daddy! Thank you, Cecilia House, for the follow. Much appreciated. Um, this community is all about positivity and inclusion. Butch McBalls, welcome to the stream. Daddy! Let me know Daddy. where you're from. Let me know your pet's name. Let me know your favorite sandwich, new folks, so I can sing you your welcome song. Welcome to the coal mine. Pleasure to have you here. Welcome. We're just chatting about all kinds of things. Dude on wheels on YouTube. Good to see you again. How are you? How have you been? Give me an update, please. The best head ever. My goodness. I love the best things. And you're the best ever. That's wonderful. Elias Schaefer on Twitch says, I haven't checked in more than once or twice since the SourceFed days, but still love you, man. Hope you're killing it and doing well, Lieberman. Elias Schaefer, I really appreciate you. I hope that you are doing well, happy, healthy, safe. All my best to you, your family, your friends. I really appreciate that message, and uh, I hope that you hang. And if not, that's all good, too. Wishing you all the best. Um, let's see. All right, Cecilia House. Uh, show my Wi-Fi speed. <laughs> Let's do let's do a speed daddy. test. Daddy, Elias Schaefer, Daddy, thank you for the follow. Um, well, there's a little yellow. You can see a little bit of yellow. Hey, Steve, heading over to YouTube. Thank you. Welcome, Tough Cat. Good to see you, Neil. How have you been? Give me an update. Volker Benedict, good to see you. Give me an update. How was your weekend? I've got a. Uh, I've got. <laughs> Butch McBall says. Uh, this guy rocks a pop filter, so you know he's a pro. It's true. Um, been better, but also can't complain about too much, I guess. Of course you can, dude, one wheels. You can complain about whatever you want. This is America. And even if it's not America where you are, it's America here. So by transitive property, you can complain about whatever you would like to me, and it will count. Oh, yes. Shovel Knight, good to see you. Welcome. I've got a I've got a coal mine song in the chamber here, and I'm gonna need some help with it. So please, if you have coal mine helmets, spam them. If you don't, spam some A's in chat. The letter A. 
Cecilia House is from Washington, D.C. Has two pets named Bell and Figaro. Maybe let me know what your favorite sandwich is. Working in a coal mine all day, every single day. With Bell and Figaro by your side. Making sure that everybody knows that you are alive. In those Washington, D.C. vibes in a coal mine. Helping us with our civic government. Helping us deliver a brand new constitution to the coal mine. Isn't that a good time? Their favorite sandwich is a PB&J. Lots of PB&J fans in the coal mine. Such a good time. Bang! Welcome to the community, Cecilia House! That's what happens. That's what happens when an air horn stays up all night instead of getting a good night's rest. Thank you, Cecilia House, for the 100 biddies. Much appreciated. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you for the A's and the coal mine helmets. The windbag, give me some details on your stream. What did you stream? No breath, coal mine song complete. We never, we never breathe. Man, I never breathe. Air horn, you mean compressed air? Watch me, like, fiddle with all my shit. I've got, like, so much stuff on top of where my air, my compressed air is. But now I need to to spray it so if my if my camera gets knocked out that's why <sighs> you do nonsense on the daily <laughs> the windbag <laughs> There's few things that make me happier than this. We need one of those signs like they have in a workplace. We need like one of those signs that they have in a workplace where it's like, you know, 57 days since our last injury. Except it's like, how many days since our last... <laughs> <laughs> oh. If you put the compressed air between your fingers, you basically make an eternal fart. Is that a thing? I would love to make it a command, Baby Glacier. Sammy, I know that you're mad at me, but like, could you, could could we figure out a way to do that? <laughs> It's totally okay if the answer is no, but if the answer is yes, I know a lot of people who would really appreciate it. JP Hepburn and David over on YouTube, toot toot, welcome. And Steve Lenhart photo, trip tabbing, a triple tabber, what up? Triple tabber over on Facebook, on YouTube, uh -oh, on Twitch, uh -oh. Kayla's Corner. Can you believe it? Thank you so much. Uh-oh, love for the raid and the one true noob daddy. Thank you for the follow over on Twitch. Daddy. Much love. Let me know where you're from. Let me know your pet's name. Let me know your favorite sandwich. Kayla, I did that for you. It was all for you. James Michael Doyle on YouTube. Welcome to the stream. Toot toot. <laughs> Oh shit. Oh shit. It's like it's like it's like I got my power back. Do you know what I mean? It's like it's like I can't Daddy. even imagine Filthiest GK Daddy <laughs> Thank you so much for the follow on Twitch. Where are you from? What's your pet's name? What's your favorite sandwich? Uh JP Hepburn says New Jersey represent. Yes, Jersey vibes. Where are you from? What county? Give me some deets, J.P. Hepburn. Steve Lenhardt Photo says, It's so quiet over here on Facebook. I'm just going to own this part of the chat. Is anyone going to join the boy, or is he going to have to chat by his lonesome on Facebook? On Facebook! Facebook.com slash Matt Lieberman official. Uh, oh, Filthy is GK also from NJ. Where at? I'm from South Orange. The one true noob is from the UK. Their pet's name is Kaiser and Ham. And their BLT is their favorite sandwich, Kaiser and ham, as in a Kaiser roll with ham on it. <gasps> Stop. 
The one true noob is from the UK. Their pet's name is Kaiser and Ham, and their BLT is their favorite sandwich. Working in a coal mine all day, every single day, with Kaiser and Ham by your side. Making sure that everybody knows that the BLT is a very nice sandwich to have in a coal mine. Such a good time having that creamy mayo with the nice bacon and the tomato and the lettuce in the coal mine. Such a good time. B -b 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 Bang! Welcome to the community, the one true noob! Yes! Melissa hopping over to Facebook. Thank you. JP Hepburn says Morris County in Denville. Very nice. And Middlesex County fam. Okay. Okay. Essex County. What up? Another victim of the song bait. James M. Doyle. There's no song bait. I love to sing these songs. I live to sing these songs. You can't take them away from me. Kayla over on the Facebook. Much love. Thank you. FHS White Stallion. Go to sleep. I love you, and I love you for popping in, but bro, if it's 4 a.m., don't stay up for my stream. Don't pop into my stream. Go get some rest, my dude. Thank you. Thank you. I'm so excited that Steve has friends over on Facebook, Kayla and Melissa and Steve. Can I do a romantic song about the Reuben because it's the best sandwich ever? Butch McBalls? I believe I can. Hello? Is it me or Reuben for? Your dressing is Russian And your toast is so wry But I know that you ain't dry Tonight, tonight, tonight The pastrami slice so thin And the crowd Daddy. is crisp, it's true But you know I need you so much my sweet rube. That's what's up, daddy. Welcome, Kilo Swastuba. How are you? Welcome to the stream. Where are you from? What's your pet's name? What's your favorite sandwich? Can you raid my friend? He needs 11 followers to become affiliate. Um, What does your friend stream? Can I check out their stream? Let me check out their stream. If they are wholesome and kind... I will direct people to follow them. How about that? But I can't guarantee a raid. Thank you very much, Sammy, for uh, requesting that clip. What did you do, Kayla? Yeah, Facebook algorithm intensifies, exactly. The more people who go and chat over on Facebook, Facebook sends the stream to, like, Dozens of people just by having three people talking on Facebook. It's wild. How long have I had that Ruben song? That was off the dome. Give me another song type and I will do it. Parody Island Pictures. Welcome to the stream on YouTube. How are you? Where are you from? What's your pet's name? What's your favorite sandwich? Filthiest GK. So shitty Wi-Fi like ate up half of our stream. Okay. We were supposed to start at 6. It's now 7.48. I've been live for 25 minutes. So we could hop over to uh, to Mystery Legends, The Phantom of the Opera, and do some freaking point-and-click puzzle solving. But honestly, I think we're just going to chill here, and I'm going to take song requests, and I'm just going to make up songs. Do a song about standing, uh, standing in line at the DMV and a sad song about shitty Wi-Fi. Okay. Mm. My gosh, there's so many people standing in this line. I wish that I could be one of them. They know exactly what they want. Only in time, they will be with a DMV rep. They're gonna get their driver's test or maybe update the photo they're gonna get that new real id my girlfriend said i don't need it Ooh yeah it's so long i've been here all my life i first came here for my test and there i met my wife the dmv 
Sad song about shitty Wi-Fi. Leona May, welcome to the stream. Thank you. How are you? Where are you from? What's your pet's name? What's your favorite sandwich? Single Davy mode. Good to see you. Lewis Cox, welcome back. Good to see you. Um, <clears throat> I thought I had a partner in this life. But it turns out my Wi-Fi is shitty. I used to think that everything I needed was provided. But my Wi-Fi is shitty. Oh, wait. I can't see Netflix. Oh, oh wait. I can't stream. Oh, wait. I meant to order something on Amazon, but now I can't because my Wi-Fi is so shitty. <clears throat> oh, you the Nightcore. Daddy. Hey, Daddy. Thank you, Jay Riojas, for the sub. Much appreciated over on Twitch. Thank you. And thank you, Steve, for lurking on all the tabs. That's what's up. Much appreciated. Yeah, LA and Ventura County got knocked out. It was crazy, man. I saw like 15,000 down requests on down detector. It was nuts. And it said that it wasn't going to be back up until 1030 tonight. Why aren't you a pro singer? I was flat. But thank you. You would buy the album? I thought about doing a comedy album years ago. I'm guessing we've already covered my Wi-Fi. Well, no, we covered my Wi-Fi, but we could cover your Wi-Fi. How is it doing? Give us an update. <laughs> Baby Glacier says, I mean, it is after 1030 here, so technically they were right. No, I meant Pacific time. It was like 1230 Central. How can you sing when you're sad? <laughs> I have to tell you, Leona May. Whoa! Jay Riojas giving out a tier one sub in the community. Thank you so much. Pink Loud, welcome to the stream. How are you? Pink Loud, I didn't even know that you streamed until I saw that you followed me on Instagram and then I saw your Twitch. When do you stream, Pink Loud? Lewis Cox's Wi-Fi is super fine over on YouTube. Leona May, I sing when I'm sad because when I'm sad, I like to make myself happy. And the best way to make myself happy is to make myself laugh. The same way that like, I don't know if you guys have ever tried this, but it's a it's a it's a it's a neat life hack. Pretend to laugh, and the more you pretend to laugh, you will actually start laughing just off of the pretending to laugh. Rio, Jay Rio has much appreciated, dude. Thank you, thank you. Like, um... <laughs> oh my gosh. You don't have a set schedule yet? Girl! What are we doing? Uh, what are we doing? Uh, pick one day. Pick one day that's like a yes. Unless something goes wrong, yes. Let's go. Single Davy mode, that is my, my purest self. The wheeze laugh is an expression of my inner being. <laughs> Pink Loud says, oh my God, yes, scold me. Woo! <laughs> Take care, single Davy mode. Pink loud. The, the, the best thing you can do, like you already did the best thing, right? Which is just start. The next step is just set one time that you are definitely going to keep so people know to come back. So one thing that I've sucked at for a while that I always was very hard on my coaching clients with and, my, and like in my classes is um is your relationship that you're building with your audience 
is based on a trust. And that trust is, will you be there when I expect you to be there? When you say you're going to be there. If I don't know when you're going to be live, I can't build my schedule around you. So pick one day, one time that you know you will be live so that the people who like what you do know to show up there and then. Alexa, remind me to stream. Thank you, Butch McBalls. Uh, Drotante says, where's your Instagram? I think I have a shitty broken link, but if you're on Twitch, it should be underneath my my stream. I'm going to literally check and see if it's the right link. And if not, we'll fix it now. Nope, it's correct. That's the one. Damn, I dropped by a ton. <laughs> Whoops, when the fuck did that happen? <laughs> I've been telling people I was over 30K on on Instagram. I used to be over 50K on Instagram. Now I'm down to 27.8. Jeez, what did I do? <laughs> Whoops. Anyway, it works. <laughs> and the good news is, of late, Pettigrew, I'm in a committed relationship. Respect my boundaries. It's all the compressed air <laughs> you're right um sad song about lost subscribers <laughs> man what did i do to push you away what did i not do to keep you what did I do in the first place to keep you on my channels? I wish you were here to tell me, but you're not. Oh, I miss you like a person that I've never met and will never meet again. You might stop by someday to say, Hey, I think I used to watch you when I was like 12. Haha. <laughs> what are you up to now? And I'll say, well, you know, this. And you'll say, nothing, because you've already moved on to something else. But that's cool. I respect your journey. I love this journey for you. Ooh, ooh, you, double you, you. Ooh. <laughs> Brown Town Reviews over on YouTube. Hello. Matt, my bro, got a DUI. My PS4 broke and my car got a flat tire. My mom's crying. I'm crying. I'm alone at work in a night ship. Help. Okay. Brown Town. That is fucking rough. And I'm sorry that that is your world right now. I want you to hear one thing from me, okay? It may not feel that way right now, but everything always works out for you. And I'll tell you how I know. Everything always works out for you because you are here right now to send me that message. You have handled harder shit, worse shit, more shit when you were less equipped to handle that. Whether it made you happy, whether it made you sad, whether it made you cry, whether it made your life. Everything that has happened so far in your life, every choice, everything that happened out of nowhere brought you to this moment right here, right now. And that's how I know that you're going to be able to get through this moment to a much better one. Push through, hang out, lean on us, lean on the community like we fucking love you, man. Come hang. There are so many people here that will give you like the pump up and the courage because we've all had horrible fucking days or weeks or months in the last 12 months. So by fate or by choice, you wound up in the right place. I hope that that helped a little bit and I hope that we can help some more. 
Atheist Unicycle on YouTube says, bring back SourceFed and Arrested Development, the good kind. I agree with those. And thank you, Kayla, for being a multi-tabber. I think I watch you when you're 12 is a brilliant line and delivery. It's, it is the, it is the journey for so many people <laughs> who used to be my subscribers and so many people who are still subscribers. When do we get Lieberman plays only fans? We're going to get a Patreon, not an only fans. Okay, good. I'm so glad Brown town. I'm so glad you're here. And I'm so glad I was able to do that for you. Everything's going to be all right, man. Nothing's going to be perfect, and nothing's going to be great forever, but everything will be all right. That I can guarantee. Here, you guys want to see more of the yellow wall? Let's let's fuck some shit up right quick. Yeah. Let's swing, 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 swing your partner. Got it. How's that angle? That's like almost right. No? Oh, bye, Leona May. Much love to you. Take care. Be safe. Be healthy. Be happy. Hope to see you again soon. Lieberman OnlyFans would consist of nothing but toe pics? Why toes? What? At what point have I given you the impression that toes are a part of my journey? What if I have no toes? Come on, man. Yeah, all the foam is, is uh, for vo stuff but really more than anything like if we're being real if there's anyone who does vo in the audience they're like man that's just decorative because you can see the wall so it, it's not super useful but it does help reduce noise it does help but it's not it's not uh professional you can't walk without a big toe i'm flexing both of my big toes so they cannot be used and i'm walking around like this just more proof that you can do anything if you put your mind to it that's what's up here let's try that myth busted that's right excuse me <laughs> My God, he's chosen. Says Brown Town. <laughs> um, Pink Loud. People are really into feet. As I discovered, to my surprise, when a friend explained this to me a couple of years ago, apparently there is like a good, like a significant, like 30 to 40% of the population, men and women, can, are not and will not be physically attracted to anything other than feet. This number astounds me. I said it must be fake. And she said, nope. I've seen the proof and it's in my DMs. And there is nothing you should trust more than the filth that men fill women's DMs with. It is their purest id and their purest truth. True story. The system works, Brown Town. I'm really happy to hear that. Yeah, 30 to 40%. Can you believe? I once knew a kid named Toey missing his big toe. He walked fine-ish. Well, Toey couldn't have possibly been his real name. <laughs> um, feet are gross. I don't think feet are gross, but I also don't, I'm not one of the 30 to 40%. I also don't think that the 30 to 40% can be the correct figure, but she seemed pretty certain that, I, I, I don't know. Thank you, J. Rio Haas, for sharing. You like ears. Hmm. What do you like about ears? Can I ask that? Is that a question? readjusting i'm gonna move back to my spot i know people like my walls but 
I'm gonna move back. Ugh. I have it set up this way. Come on. Oh, you little, you jerk. The little screw on the on the GoPro is just, ooh, nasty. There we go. Peter, hello. What's up, Pete? <laughs> Do you think Nostril plays a thing? And Butch McBall says, who knows? I mean, I think anything is potentially a thing. Peter, how have you been? I'm always happy to see you. Oh, that is tragic, Melgur. Huh. I don't know anybody who's lost a toe. Unfamiliar. It's not it's not something that I that I've experienced really. It's been a while since we've had legend Jim Carrey on the stream. That's true. Jim Carrey used to regale us with stories. Tinseltown tales. How are you, sir? Ooh, holding in a sneeze. Does anyone else do this when you're holding in a sneeze? It's all in the nose area. Huh. Yeah. We've been working on I'm Dying up here season three. Nobody wants to get near it, though. Social distancing, obviously. Of course. Showtime original. <laughs> Oh. All right. I think we're going to raid out unless anybody has any more song requests. I'm just looking for... Hmm. Hmm. He wasn't very nice, went with the name through high school. But again, small towns get used to accepting nicknames as actual names. So he took on the name. That was like a like a him choice. Not what I would have expected. That's not what I would have expected at all. Hmm. Well, I hope that he's happy. I hope that he's got some joy in his life. I want that more than anything. All right, so Snickers, Skittles, Tonka, and Toei. Are these all the same person or or four different people? Um, what time do you usually end your streams? I usually end somewhere between 8 and 8.30 p.m. Pacific. So we're in that window, but normally we start the streams earlier. So normally the streams are longer. Um, yeah. I don't know. It's just uh, due to the Wi-Fi issues, uh, we lost out on some of that time. But we'll get it back tomorrow. Yeah, Spectrum was just too sassy today. Spectrum had an attitude. Spectrum had an attitude. Mm, I'm Spectrum. I want everyone to pay attention to me, taking me for granted. I want everyone to know that if you lost me, you'd be useless. They're not Wi-Fi issues are not the worst, but I react as if they are the worst. And they are bad when that's literally you need it for your job. That's the one time that I'm like, "Ooh, I'm hopping mad." That is definitely a clip, baby glacier. You freak out when your stream goes crazy. What do you set your bit rate at? Just, just ask, just asking. Cause I have found, even though I can set my bit rate up to 6,000 kbps, that just by having it, oh, only 2,500. <gasps> oh boy. What's your upload speed? See, I cut mine in half 
and now I don't have as many issues. But like, whoa! Fucking with you at 2,500? And we're sure it's an internet thing, not a computer thing, not a GPU thing or a CPU thing? Have you tried having your task manager open while you're streaming to see what's up? Frontier, Tucker Krat? You don't even know I'm so bad at computers. Okay, so um, Pink Loud, if you're on Windows 10, hop into that search bar at the bottom of your screen and uh, type in Task Manager, okay? Once you've opened it, go down to its little icon on your task bar, right click it and, and tap the thing that says pin to task bar. And then, so what does it do the task manager? So it used to be when, when, when I was a kid, we'd call it control alt delete. It's a, um, it's a, a window that shows you, um, what apps you have open and what's running in the background and what each program, how much of your CPU, your memory and your GPU each program is using so when your stream starts going crazy it may not be your internet at all it might be your computer is overloaded so i find that when i'm running obs and discord and chrome and a game at the same time especially if discord is rendering video like someone on video chat my stream might crash because my computer is crashing so having task manager open doesn't use a lot of um, memory or CPU, but it'll show you how your computer is performing and it might help you troubleshoot in the moment what's going on. And then you can kind of make changes accordingly. Another thing you may want to consider doing if you haven't already um, is go into your Discord or go into your OBS settings and and uh find out what your encoder is in OBS so you can set your encoder to um hardware or like graphics card hardware is called NVENC um and then your graphics card is is your GPU um you want to consider moving your encoder to NVENC versus your GPU because your GPU is being used for anything that involves video, any gaming, anything like that. So you want to take load off of your GPU because typically, and I don't know the build of your computer, but typically your, your CPU and your memory will be stronger than your GPU. But again, I don't know, I don't know your computer. But yeah, you may want to consider instead of doing the um video chat on discord you could consider instead um one of two things right you could either just do audio voice chat from the discord or um you could do something like Streamyard, where uh something like Streamyard, where you can have your meeting your video meeting and it's entirely online so discord doesn't have to render any video so you could just capture that um you could capture that, uh, what's it called? That window of Chrome or whatever you're using for, for a browser. Any advice for aspiring voice actors? I never even knew where to get started. Um, train. So there are classes, and now with, uh, with COVID, they've moved online. Um, so I would start with a class like Kalmanson and Kalmanson. They're not cheap, but they're like the gold standard for beginners for a reason um Kalmanson and Kalmanson um if you can do private coaching with um there's a woman named Sarah Jane Sherman who is a uh an incredible casting director for voices Spiffy thank you for the 11 month resub much love to you can we get some A's in chat please for Spiffy goat holy shit Almost a year. Are you kidding me? Um. Anyway, uh, I would take classes. Um. There are also great uh like vocal exercise stuff online that you can take a look at. Welcome, Paul the dude. Good to see you. And um. 
Let me see. So once you've trained up, right, you'll want to make reels. I don't know what part of the country you live in, Butch McBalls. You might have told me. Tell me again. Um, so you want to make a commercial reel and an animation reel um, and maybe a narration reel. How do you do this? So literally grab, uh, grab commercial copy from commercials that you hear on the radio um, and, uh, and record it. And then take just a snippet. It could be like three to five seconds or, or even 10 seconds at the longest just to give a flavor of a type of read you could do. Um, the Frog is from uh, Meet the Robinsons, which is an early Libra Friends community meme. Um, you're from Maryland. Okay, so I would take a look and see if there I – would, I would check out Maryland and New England-based voiceover reps, regional voiceover reps, um, because there are, right? Because there are definitely – uh, radio spots and voiceovers in your region that you would be right for, that they would want a local voice for, and it will be a lot easier to get that work than to get work inter nationally and internationally. If you do want to spend some money, you can join uh, Voices.com and Voice123.com, which both have a ton of non-union voiceover jobs that you can audition for, but having those reels is going to help you get... Um, get a, an agent and your agent will wind up sending you the majority of your auditions. Does that make sense? I wish you the best of luck, luck, Butch. Um, do I have here? I may be able to play you my commercial reel. Let me find it. One second, gang. Oh, here we go. You did some entries for spoken Wikipedia articles too. You could also check out um, acx.com if you want to try um, recording some audiobooks. There's a ton of people looking for people to narrate their um, their like self-published books just to get the experience and to, to build up a body of work. All right, so this is my commercial reel from a couple of years ago. Um, check Check this out. It's time to refinance your student loans with SoFi. You could get a lower monthly payment, amazing customer service, and you could see your rate in just two minutes. Ooh, I need to call my brother, but the phone is so far away. I just got all curled up in my perfect blanket. He'd understand, right? Philip and Conoco then drive out to a location that's middle of nowhere adjacent and attempt to make first contact with extraterrestrials by shouting the names of different appetizers up at the night sky. In case you can't tell, this is an ad for Go Car Insurance. Go is the very first on-demand car insurance exclusively for iPhone. At some point, a line has to be drawn. For us, that line is five minutes from the store to make sure every sandwich arrives freaky fast and freaky fresh. There's a movement taking place. It's all happening at an unprecedented and accelerating rate along the edge. True car, quite possibly the easiest way to buy a car. So you see that? It's not even a minute, right? 53 seconds, but in there you get like seven different types of copy that I would that I was getting a lot or that like my voice kind of fits like I have sort of like a a higher pitched men's voice um I can I can take it low but it's not my natural so it's a very specific type of 
it's a very specific type of low voice. I'm not going to get the car. Unless it's something like, hey, did you hear that Honda is now offering blah, 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 blah. Um, so, like, do some recording. Listen to your voice. Get a sense of, like, what are... Hey! Oh, boy. We're ending just as we end, gang. It happened. YouTube memberships are now live. YouTube memberships are now officially live over on uh, youtube.com slash Matt Lieberman. If you go to the stream, you can tap that. Or if you're already on it, you can refresh. You can tap that little join button. Um, and you can you can join as a member on YouTube. I'm so stoked. I'm so stoked. And then once we have three members, I'll be able to add more emotes from uh, from the Twitch stream over to YouTube. Kids, what do you mean you missed it? You missed the voiceover or you missed what I just said? You could still be the first, kids. You could be the very first member on YouTube. All right. <clears throat> With that in mind, it is 820. Um, I am going to raid out on Twitch and and the YouTube and Facebook streams. I really appreciate everybody uh, who hung out. Thank you for being here. Thank you for spending your time with me. I love spending my time with you. Um, I really like these streams where we just get to chat. And I'd like to do a lot more of this in the future. Tucker. We're going to talk about 90 Day Fiance. I'm going to watch Sunday's episode, and we're going to get into it tomorrow. Believe you me. And if we have to, we will go full on Discord voice chat debate. Hey, Melissa and Steve are over on YouTube. Hooray. Thank you, Melissa and Steve, for going to YouTube. La gasp. That's right, Tucker Krat. Be ready. Be ready. You can't even hangle it. That's right. So hopefully tomorrow during the only show, we will have our first actual... Your, your members? It doesn't even show it on my end. Can you use the emotes in, in, in YouTube? You'll be the very first to use the emotes. Oh, wow. There you are. Melissa was, was, <laughs> wait. Who was, yeah, Melissa. No, Steve was first. Or was Melissa first? Who was first? You're able to use, so, okay. So I can't see the actual emotes in my, ch in my restream chat. That's interesting. But you're using them. That's so cool. Thank you so much, gang. Why? What? Is my mouse dead? The heck? Hi, Lewis. Uh, my mouse is dead. This is embarrassing. What if he cannot end the stream? It was Steve by 0.2 seconds. What if he cannot end this stream and he is stuck here forever? Come on, do I have any triple A's? <laughs> Lewis, how was your day? Okay, Mouse is back. Harley Robinson, welcome on YouTube. Hello. Adios. Adios, muchacho. See you tomorrow, perhaps. We're gonna we're gonna raid out and we are gonna be back tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. Pacific. My day was great, Lewis. Thank you so much for asking. Much love to you. Hope you, your family, your friends are all doing well. Happy, healthy, and safe. Um so I'm going to raid out to uh, Zach of all trades, Zach Taylor from the uh, SourceFed days. 
Um, he's streaming right now on Twitch, and uh, we're gonna give him a little surprise. He's playing some uh, Sea of Thieves. Some Sea of Thieves. Thank you very much, Lewis. Much appreciated. Yeah, I've never seen him live, but he stopped by once and said that he streamed, so I followed him. He just happens to be live right now. Um, so we're we're all going to say, if you're on Twitch and you're rating, say, yo, ho, ho, and a bottle of fun. Yes, do that. Please do that. And thank you very much, Melissa. Happy membership day. We done did it. That's so cool. We beat out the clock, 80s. We did it. We got memberships before I fell below 300,000. <laughs> and then thus couldn't do them anymore. We freaking did it. Uh, ooh, yo-ho-ho and a bottle of fun might not work because you got, you got, uh, I had to add it. So we're gonna we're gonna change our minds, uh, and we're just gonna say, uh, "Cool pirates, <laughs> cool pirates." Okay, cool exclamation point pirates exclamation point. Much love. Take care. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. Hey. YouTube and Facebook. Hi. I love you. See you later.